All right, so I'm gonna cut one of these packs up and show you how I'm taking it from four wide and taking this pack and folding it back and turning it into a five wide. Okay, now <laughs> I'm just a fucking hack. I'll admit that straight up. I'm sure if you know what you're doing way better or you have like special glue or like you're more of a techie person that you could probably do this way better and way cleaner. I don't care. Somebody's gonna wanna see how to do it at least. If you have some better information on how to do it more properly, feel free. Um, yeah, I'm afraid of getting shocked, and, uh, but I didn't get last time. So, you know what? And my soldering skills are really crappy too, but I got the job done. So if you wanna see how it's done, one way or another, if you think you can do it better, do it better. Great, more power to you. But hopefully you like a little bit of dance music in the background because I'm tired of sitting in silence. So that's what we're gonna work on, right? I'm gonna take the shrink wrap off. You can see under here, I'm just gonna snip very carefully because I don't wanna like short circuit anything as well. Yeah, this is what I have. I'm not an electrician. I'm gonna peel back the, the wrap. See we have the LG batteries, LG E A M F one one eight six five blah blah blah. The BMS is on the side, okay. And then this one up here is tacked down. There's a little sticky sheet on the bottom, and you can see that these four right here they're both in parallel on the top, and then connected together in series. So I'm gonna take this and fold it together and make that happen, okay. Up here. Um, this wire extended just fine on the main positive lead. It was actually the one that connected from here to here that I had to break the solder and then redo it later on for both this and the, uh, the BMS wire. So that's the thing I had to change. Here, I'm gonna cut these apart so that I can bend them back. I feel like this wire is actually a little bit smaller this time than the last time he made the BMS, but I could be wrong. And we'll see what happens. Okay, so I'm gonna get the soldering gun hot and we'll be right back. Okay, so I'm gonna melt this one off. Melt the solder here so I can disconnect this wire. So that's off. Now I can move this around a little bit more. Uh, this wire is fine last time. So basically, so now I have this side over here. I'm going to fold these two in half, actually. But before I do that, I'm gonna put a little tape on the end. One like this, kind of cap it. And this other wire might be okay. I don't know yet. This is weird, the way they did it this time. Definitely not consistent. So let's cut the bottom little thing here so that everything peels apart. I might have to extend that wire. I'm gonna bend it first and see. built the battery different this time than the last time. Probably should have just cut another one open and seen what would have happened. So I'm probably going to have to extend this sensor wire. I'm going to need to go from here to here. It's okay if we have a little extra. I'd rather have extra.
There we go. 